a couple right here and there. Happy Pride. Yeah. How you doing? That's what's up. How long y'all been? Uh, six months. Y'all just getting going. How did y'all meet six months? You were her manager? You were like, you want to raise? <laughs> I can do that for you. <laughs> I'll give you four more dollars an hour. You know? So did you holler at her or she hollered at you? I didn't holler at her and she flat out rejected me. What? Yeah. Dickhead? Yeah. I got your back. I got your back. I got your back, bro. <laughs> well, how did you holler though? That you got re- did you you step correct or you came kind of sideways? Uh, she was just sending me signals at work. So I'm, I text, I'm like, hold on, hold on, that's loaded now. Yeah. Fuck you mean she was sending you signals at work? She was like, look. <laughs> what signals was she showing you? Hey, Bob. What? She was touching you? Right. Your dick was hard as a motherfucker. She touched. <laughs> That's the stupidest shit I've said in at least like three months on my mom. <laughs> I just told a lesbian her dick was hard, bro. That's ridiculous. That's, that's, I'm, I'm sorry. You deserve it. She's like, no, it is hard, though. It's just in my glove compartment. You want to see it? I'll be right back. <laughs> so you was touching on her shit. No, it's the case when we were playing around. So like, you were playing? Yeah. You were like, ah, ha, 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 ha. She was like, yo, what the fuck was that? You want to go on a date? Ew, a date with you? Basically. Really? Just a fling or y'all really love each other for real? Y'all going to make it? Okay. What y'all got in common? Nothing. Yeah, y'all gonna make it. <laughs> it's when people got too much shit to be like, these motherfuckers are gonna be sick of each other. We both like to read. We both like to walk. We both like to ride bikes. <laughs> That's cool at first. Two, two years in, you on your bike like, get away from this. <laughs> Why are you going so fast? <laughs> That's a good laugh. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name, big boy? <laughs> you order with that voice? Let me get a uh let me get a motherfucking whole pizza and a um <laughs> What do you do for a living, Anthony? You a food critic? <laughs> this is what he wanted, f y'all. <laughs> what do you do for money, Anthony? Huh? You work at Home Depot? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I don't know why you wooing them the worst employees in the goddamn world. For real. You ever been to Home Depot? You can't ever find them. You be on the aisle for an hour like, is anybody work here? Fuck. Where are the fucking screws? <laughs> you look at the end of the aisle, you just see an orange shirt go by. You run down there. Yo! Yo! <laughs> They're all hiding in some shit they built on aisle 13. <laughs> Home Depot. You be hiding at work? Huh? <laughs> yeah, you can. Just because you fat don't mean you can't hide. You just easy to find. <laughs> you ever see the fat kid trying to play hide and go seek? Motherfucker behind the tree, like, you can't find me. Wait, bro, your stomach's sticking out. Anthony, we found you. <laughs> if I can't see you, you can't see me. <laughs> you should work at Home Depot one day. I will. 